San Francisco has almost 3,500 restaurants to choose from. That is more per capita than any big city in the United States. Yes, and San Francisco is also extremely popular amongst hipsters. And that's why some clever restaurant owners developed special hipster menus. Is that right, Tara? Yeah, definitely. Um, as you know, hipsters are always looking for hidden gems and new restaurants and side dishes. Some items have become so popular that you can find them in a ridiculous amount of restaurants of different variations. Can you give us a few examples of the dishes? Yeah, um, there's the shishito pepper, which is a Japanese pepper that's mild in spice and it's served as an appetizer. There are uh, deviled eggs, which are hard boiled eggs that are cut in half and the yolks are mixed with other ingredients like mayonnaise or uh, mustard and paprika. They make an appearance at almost every trendy restaurant and they have their own kick. The classic eggs benedict are poached eggs topped with hollandaise sauce and comes with toppings now such as prosciutto or tomato. And uh, you have a food blog, a popular food blog in San Francisco. Do you think that the dish dishes are delicious? Yeah, I mean they usually never fail. Um, but when I go out to eat I really like to try what the house specializes in. But I can't lie, I love Benedict's for lunch. <laughs> There's just something about the yolk that oozes out and it gets me every time. Mm, sounds good. But how do the hipsters respond on this? Um, they're very enthusiastic, of course. Um, these dishes are you know, one of the most popular items on the menu. The trend of organic and sustainability, for instance, is enormous and something I support to the fullest extent. Uh, complicated cocktails and mason jars and exotic spice top dishes are also important to keep people coming in. But yeah. for some restaurant owners, there's a healthy eating has come full circle, kind of. For example, there's a restaurant called Mission Chinese, and they have salt shakers with uh, MSG in them, and they announce it as the authentic option. Sounds very good. For more information, just go to foodandotherthings.com. Thank you. Thank you.